Bistro on Top is really a more the French, the modern French restaurant, and it was more it's the concept of Bistro on Top is 80% French, 20% Malaysian influence. Antara is actually the flip of that. So Antara is 80% Malaysian with a 20% French influence. The reason why I wanted to open up Antara was because there were dishes that you know are still a chimera of two cuisines, but. Um, it was not identifiably uh, French, which is why I needed, I wanted a, another outlet so that I could channel all these more Malaysian, identifiably more Malaysian uh, dishes into this outlet. So we've got like a couple of concepts going. We've got Antara, the fine dining side, so that's the more Asian, Asian influence local side of the food. Uh, we also have and then Abacus uh, Lounge, which is more local centric cocktails. You know that kind of glass house colonial old man feel to it. And then you've got downstairs, which is like Anson Colonial Cafe. So that's more like the Hainanese uh, colonial aspect of Malaysian cuisine. We're looking at concentrating on so much effort that goes into that bowl or you know that plate. Um, using superior quality ingredients that you would never be able to um, eat in a normal Malaysian context. I mean, you know, like we're talking about really upping the luxe factor when it comes to local food. It's not just French food that you get to spoil yourself, but you can actually spoil yourself with really top Malaysian food too. The toughest thing is um, getting the right team. And when it came to just um, even building and you know sourcing things I you know personally sourced like I went to Singapore to like buy these little um, you know uh, Chinese porcelain you know I went all over the place I got these bags from Auckland I, um, I literally planted these uh, bonsais everything that you see in there is really literally my blood sweat and tears being in the industry where you're surrounded by people who are giving that is great because you know, all we want to do is just feed each other, right? And that's what I love.